Oh boy. Hey, Z damn, Zara, fucking on the ball. That's quick. How you doing today, Zara? What are you up to? You saw me launch Oblivion, was waiting. <laughs> I see. Hmm. I, I fixed the mod. That door was supposed to be there. Also, Bella's with me. Bella's hanging out for a bit. Huh? Yay. She's just chilling. Gonna let her out of my room here in a bit. I'm gonna put my hand in your mouth. Get over here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> she's so proud of herself. She gives me her paw and she's just like, I did it. I have done trick. <laughs> she's so happy. She's still a baby, but she's a good dog. If at least managed to train her a bit. And now she's not, uh, she's not all crazy. Mm. Orange juice. Orange juice. Wow, damn, almost 30 hours of playtime. That's crazy. Eh? Hold on one moment. I shouldn't be getting that. <coughs> because all of the mods that were installed should be installed. Hold on. Everybody is good. Zara, thank you for the Prime sub. I appreciate it. Oh! You son of a bitch. The game un uncheckmarked the, uh, uncheckmarked one of my mods. Doggos are love. Indeed they are. Wow, it's almost been two years, Zara. That's crazy. That's crazy. 23 months. How does that make you feel? How crazy do you find that? Capture. There we go. Thank goodness it gave me that warning, because that, that told me that something was up. I was like, something's up. Something is wrong here. Ultimate nipple blast. Good, good. We are set. We have the spell. The spell. Maybe a month or two? That's crazy. That's so crazy. 
So crazy. Currently just waiting a little bit to see if anyone else joins before I go deal with Manny Marco. Hack. Oh, that's cute. He's got a little upside down heart on his nose. Oh, well, that's adorable. Aw. You see, he's meant to look all intimidating, but then he's got like little subtle things like that. It's really just... You know, shows that he wants friends. Also, uh... I, I, I get that it's four fingers and a thumb, but... It really does just look like six fingers. Actually, yeah, this one... Really does just look like six fingers. Because... Uh, hold on. Yeah, if the, if the thumb's on the inside, like... Jeez... He's got a really long thumb. Like that thumb, yeah, that's pretty big, but that thumb goes up to his eyeball. Jeez. He's got long thumbs. That's a very long thumb. Yeah, you get it, Miss Pyra. How's it going? How are you today, Miss Pyra? Bought the expansion coming out for ESO on June 1st. Nice! I'm currently, uh, some, some of my free time, not a lot, but some of my free time is going towards, uh, the Old Republic. Because, uh, I recently got back into that and was like, you know, it's pretty dang good. It's pretty dang good. Uh, I am tempted to try to get back into, uh, Final Fantasy fourteen after, uh, after, uh, that one, what was it, the, uh, the composer, who exactly was it? One of the, uh, people working on the music came out as, uh, working on it while he had cancer, and I was like, you know, if you're, if you're gonna do something like that, like, I, I, I feel obligated. I feel like I really should. You have a, you had a panini for supper? A fucking, li when I graduated from high school, I was given a panini maker. I don't know where that thing went. But yeah, I was given a panini maker. It's like this tool that, like, you, um... I mean, you basically just make a sandwich, but then you put it in between this presser that just... It's pretty awesome. Make me a panini? I don't know where my panini maker is. I don't know where the thing went. I didn't appreciate it when I first got it. I was like, Ugh, this is stupid. I would rather have just been given money. Uh, and now I'm like, man, I could really go for a panini right now. Grilled sandwiches are pretty damn tasty. The great mystery of the panini maker caper. Is that going to be your next book, Pyra? Is that your next book? Don't forget to oil them, too. Yeah. I I saw this corpse on the wall, and I thought it was a lizard. I was like, whoa, a lit- wait. I was so disappointed to find out it wasn't a lizard. Huh. There's blood on the floor over there. I don't see a trap. Unless. Oh, it's fine. Oh, is that Manny Marco? Hey, Manny! Manny! Manny Marco! Yo, Manny! I always just put the, uh, the oil on the bread itself. Which, you know, it hasn't burned my thing yet. Oh, that's... Oh, okay. 
I thought you were saying, like, oil my panini maker, and I was like, I mean, I, I don't think you have to if it's, if it's, uh, releasing when you unrelease it. Okay, you, he's got dead, yo, yo, Manny, yo, Manny, Manny, nice dancers, nice dancers, I think he likes me. Yo, what's up, dude? Ah! <laughs> the fuck, man? Try to approach you and. Dude! I see Bullard was unsuccessful. This is a lot better. You. Very well. I shall reanimate him once we are done here. This Perhaps is a lot better. we shall chat for a while, since you really have no other options. I must say, I expected Archmage Traven, rather than his star pupil. <coughs> I am disappointed to see that he could not face me himself. I have met so many of his predecessors over the years. I developed a particular fondness for Galerian, ill-preserved though he may be. But here you are instead. Skilled this enough so to make better. it this far, which speaks volumes about you. Perhaps you'll be as useful to me as Traven would. Um So so what uh one thing I have to appreciate is uh uh the fact that it's voiced but heavily distorted. If I had to guess they use the actual voice line but then distorted it uh with just like some with just some filters and whatnot in order to make it sound spookier but no this is a lot better this is definitely a lot better than what we dealt with it's a shame other people didn't arrive early on in order to see us fight manny marco the actual manny marco what we dealt with before that guy he was just bitch boy mcgee this is the true manny marco uh, I'll serve you if you spare me. You're pretty intimidating, jeez. I am afraid you misunderstand. I already have more servants than I need. That's Your not true. Body will be I killed most of them. As a worm thrall. Oh. Your soul is mine. I intend to study both to learn more about the source of your power. Um, intense training. I mean, what? Power, my dear friend. I seek power. And so I acquire and study those who have some degree of it. Well. We are after the same things, your guild and I. Yet you worry about good and evil. No, I don't. And do not accept there are manifestations of the same thing. I killed a person for charging so me money to train me. A villain. And make vain attempts to destroy me. I watch. N no. And I wait. And I collect you when you come for me. Listen, dude, you're instead worth a lot of, of XP. drawing Traven out, I have received you instead. Perhaps I shall personally go and collect him when we are done here. He's dead, man. He got turned into a soul gem. I did not come unprepared, however. We shall see how prepared you actually are. I learned the ultimate nipple punch. <laughs> ah! Where'd you come from? Push. <laughs> Push. Uh, yeah, let's take one of my restore health potions. Ha! Ah, you son of a bitch! My intelligence! Haha! <laughs> I got your boots, you son of a bitch! Now what are you gonna do? I got your boots! They're not even magical?
Damn it, he absorbed some of my magic. I gotta push all of his skeletons down. Ah! Push. Push. Ah! Hold on, time out, time out. I gotta regen my mana. Hold on, hold on. I'm I'm an Atronach. First sign. It, it's kind of hard. There we go. Ah! Ah! I fell down. No! Ooh! Yeah, I gotta use these uh, this pillar to my advantage. Manny? Manny? Manny, the fuck you do- Manny! Manny, calm down! What the fuck have you s- He summoned death! Not cool! Ha! Ow! Ah. Manny! Manny! Can you punch the skeleton's nipples effectively? Uh, pretty effectively. This thing, though, not so much. Ah, he don't give a fuck. You have been weakened to fire. Ah, yes. Give me that. Ha ha, Manny Marco. I have def I have conquered death. It's just worth a lot of mun muns. I, I guess it has a damage of 21. Bam! Look at me now, Manny! I got a scythe! Manny! I'm ready! Ow. Okay, this doesn't do anything. This does nothing in my hands. <coughs> Ow. <clears throat> I'm trying to make sure I stay at, you know, my max health, you know, quote-unquote max health. Whoops. Oh, that's the rest of that. Oh my goodness, my health is fucked. This guy's really pounding me. I have the mighty goblin staff. Take this! And this! And some of that! Ah, I'm still dying! <coughs> Caught it just in time. Ah! Push. Push. Ah. This guy's beating me up. Ha ha! I have the high ground now, Annie. Ah.
Stop. Haha! -ha! One. Manny, I know we got off on the wrong foot. I promise we can work things out. 20 damage is shit now. Damn it! Hey, Johnny. How's it going? Oh, yeah. A and yeah, it, it, it is the frost damage over time. No, I, I know what it is. <laughs> I'm just saying. It's pretty... It's pretty annoying to deal with. Aha! Frick. Okay, yeah, I'm dying of frost damage. Oh, it's frost and shock. Okay, yep, I'm gonna need, uh, that. Okay. Uh, in any case, how's it going, Johnny? Take this! And that! And some of this! Ah! Ah, no! Damn it! Who would've thunk that the ads would be so awful? Eh, fair enough, Casey. Fair enough. Push. Push. Ah! Wait! You summoned this already? What? I absorbed that one. Sir. Sir. Quick save. Ha ha! Checkpoint, motherfucker. Eh? Hello. Oh. oh. I mean, you're you're not wrong, Pyra. The ultimate nipple punch is pretty ineffective against him. In fact, it it's better for me to not kill all of the Skelegoos because he'll just summon more. Damn it! Oh. Ah. That one get you? I think it got you. Ooh. Time out. I was about to say, I should really have gotten a uh, dispel magic so that I could get rid of the silence. And then I kind of thought about it for a moment and went, wait a second. You, you need to stop moving so much. He also needs to stop glitching out so much, but, you know, details. Oh. I think I accidentally killed the skeleton. Okay. Push. 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 Ah, ha, ha. That's upsetting. The skeletons also provide some cover for me. Oh, did I do it? I did it! <laughs> that was a little anticlimactic. This is where turn on dead spells would come in handy for those skeleton summonings. Yeah, but who needs those? Who needs turn undead? I have killed the King of Worms. I shall announce to the Arcane University to announce his defeat. Wait, what? Give me that. Ah, 
Huh, you're just a, you're just a skull now. Stop floating. Stop it. Ow! Ah! Oh. Well, that's just embarrassing. Okay, well, you know it was. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I got so caught up. Fuck. Okay, what one more time. Hold on. <laughs> Whoops. I got so caught up in the victory. I I forgot to check my health. I forgot I was dying. Oh, whoops, didn't think that would kill. I'm just gonna go ahead and use up the, uh, Vulcan Stone now. Oh, and he still hit me, okay. It absolutely is. Well, that's not good. Uh, Help! Help! Uh. You won't be so smug Oof. once. I Damn it! <laughs> you won't be so smug once I die. Damn it. Ah. Okay, rush on him. Yes, he's weak. Where is he? This one fucking skeleton. Get out of here. Oof. Damn it. I gotta recharge my mana. How much does that fire spell hit for Duke? Uh, 70 damage. However, uh, with the 100% weakness to fire, it should be hitting for more. Oh my god. Jeez. <laughs> Did we trade? I don't know. All I know is I'm dying now. Whoops, that's not what I meant. <laughs> oh, well. He likes to very aggressively follow me. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> I... <sighs> Fuck. This is gonna be one of those things where I need to concentrate, huh? Ha! Ah, ah! I'm stuck! Help! Help! Ah! Ah! <laughs> no, it was not the first fireball I got that dealt like five damage per second. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, I think uh I think just hitting him with this range fireball is going to work out a lot better. Yeah, 
Yeah, so he's very aggressive in terms of his follow. Yeah, I, I have it figured out. Yeah, just gotta keep one Skelegoo alive. And kind of dance around these pillars. Oh, whoops. Guess I killed it. Go away, sir. Got him. Didn't even get hit that time. Get fucked, nerd. Quick save. Game crashed. I quick saved this time, though. I quick saved. So it's okay. I've heard about. Uh, ooh, that could be bad. That could be very bad, actually. <laughs> Because there is a glitch with this mod of uh, of it crashing a after you've killed Manny Marco. So uh, even though I have the f the thing that's supposed to fix it, shit. Yeah, fuck. God, hold on. Let me take a look at a thing. See if... Yeah. yeah. Hello. Oh, there it goes. Mod order. No, the. Ooh, that's bad. It's set up right. Uh oh. try doing that and maybe they'll fix it maybe okay well this save file, this save file might be borked <laughs> well not borked but like I might have to just abandon this mod <laughs> if it keeps crashing but hey we won and that's what matters right us winning And it wasn't just like a quick like nipple punch like three times and win. Might be able to get out of here before. Mask of the Dark and Mage. Detect life a hundred feet. Drain personality a hundred. Sun damage, 3 points on self, and fortified magicka, 50 points. I don't need the- Fuck! Yep. Yeah, it's just gonna keep doing this. I might be able to swiggity swooty my booty out of here. Maybe? <coughs> I can also teleport. Teleport somewhere else and hope that uh, it just doesn't crash the game if I'm somewhere else. <laughs> Let's see, can I just run out of here? I try not to use console commands if I can help it. No, I... 
Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Okay, well, hold on. Let me remind myself what the... Yeah, we'll just, yeah, fuck it, we'll just go to Charcoal Cave. I, I'm too lazy to look up what other locations are called. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Da -da -da, so it should be player.cmc Charcoal Cave, is that right? No, okay, so it just ain't happening. All this for a decent fight against Manny Marco. Might as well just fight. I mean, you know, we already took care of him. I'm just going to turn off the mod. I'm just going to turn off the mod and load up the, uh, the save that we dealt with that uh, already has him dead. It's not worth it, Zara. It's not worth it. I looted items from that mod. And? Yeah, there isn't anything that I can do in order to fix that. At least not to my knowledge. Because... Wouldn't that cause even more problems? Possibly? Not necessarily. You can try loading it. Yeah, the one where I already killed him, which would be this one. <coughs> uh, it just means that we don't have uh, his cool ass shit, but I'm kind of a. I don't really care much about that. <laughs> Yeah, because that mod should only affect, um... Honestly, yeah, it, it should only affect, uh, Manny Marco's cave and... Some necromancers, just some. Not very many, but some. Which, uh... If anything, now the game should go, hey, uh, the file of... These enemies are no longer here, and so it just won't load them. What's the scythe look like now? Well, this is a save uh, from before I... This is the save where I didn't even deal with uh, the modded Manny Marco. So there is no scythe. Scythe's gone. Yeah, unless we want me to sit here and finagle with, uh, with my load order or, you know, whatever for God knows how long. 
but uh, they specifically made a thing, like they acknowledged the uh, this issue of the game just crashing after you defeat Manny Marco, and uh, they created a thing specifically to deal with it. Uh, and I have it installed, but uh, apparently it just doesn't work. So, you know, there you go. Perfect. Okay. Well, I think the other, uh, the other plan for today is to go become the Arena Grand Champion, which shouldn't take very much. We're able to just kind of uh, push people on the ground. We're able to just bully people out of existence. So, let's go do this. No, 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 it's without the mod. It's without the mod. No. Damn it. Other, other side. <coughs> nah, I know the dangers of it. I know the dangers of uninstalling mods after you've already had them installed. I actually learned that lesson back when I played uh, Fallout uh, Fallout New Vegas and uh, uh, ended up loading up a save that didn't have some of the DLC on it. And the game was like, we're taking everything from you. I was like, no! My cool stuff! Then I made the mistake of saving over that save file. So that's... <laughs> that stuff was gone. Rabbits! Yep. It's all good. Hello there. Welcome to the arena. I don't think I've ever seen you around here before. I know all the regulars. Believe me. It was a cool fight. If you're looking yeah. to join the arena it as really a combatant, was. you need to head down to the Bloodworks and talk to Owen, the Blade Master. If you're here to bet on a fight, on the other hand, you're talking to the right man. There are matches all day long, from 9am to 9pm. That's a lot of chances to fill your purse with coin. So what do you say? You want to bet on hey, a match? You missed the fight with uh, real Manny Marco. We defeated him, and then in retaliation, he crashed my game. Several times, in fact. So we decided to just not deal with that. No, I don't want to bet oh, right now. All right. Very well then. If um, if you need anything, please just ask. I'll be happy to take your bet if you change your mind. How does one become arena combatant? If, by any chance, you're interested in actually fighting in the arena, you need to head down to the Bloodworks and speak with Owen, the Blade Master. Mm. Just head through the door here on my right and take the stairs down. Be on your best behavior, though. Owen is a bit cranky by nature. I see, I see. Okay, okay. A good day now. Nice. <laughs> I should not do that. Well, he's just Stop right there, criminal scum! Nobody breaks the <laughs> law on my watch! I only pushed I him down! Stolen goods. Now pay your fine, or it's off to jail. I only pushed him down, I did- Go away- <laughs> They only count it as an assault because it, it can't kill him. Then pay Stop it! Hell murder! It sounded like he said hell murder. Sit down, son. You're staying right here where I can see you. <laughs> Oh, oh no, you, you get back here, you son of a bitch. Damn it. 
Why did I put points in speed? Ha! Ha! Push! Stop! Ah. This is great. As a gun stress board geek. Hee 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 This game is fun. <laughs> this game is fun when you could just push people to the ground. Hi guys, you training? Can I train too? Oh God, there's a oh. Man down. <laughs> I win. That the best you Murder? Can do. No one's murdering anybody here. We're just pushing, see? <laughs> Hi! Ah! What's wrong with you? Jeez, crazy man! <laughs> oh, I love this game. Okay, let's reload that save. <laughs> uh, there is no consequences when you have quick save. You know, I looked online to see if there's any mods that like really change up the arena. They're real. Stop and talking already. Oh, okay. There really isn't. I'm a busy man. What is it? Hi, I don't Owen. know who you are, friend, but you've got about ten seconds to that tell me true, what Byra. you're doing in my bloodworks before I lop your arms off. You can try. Uh, I want to be a combatant. You what? You want to be a combatant? <laughs> Look at you! My granny could beat you, and she's dead! Wait, you're serious, aren't you? What is it with you people? You walk in, want to be combatants, and your entrails end up decorating my red room. That's mean. All right. It's your funeral. Welcome to the arena, you filthy pit dog. You're free to fight so long as you know the rules of competition. All right, go now, on. Now let me give you your battle raiment. It's the uniform of all arena combatants. Do you want a light raiment or a heavy raiment? Uh, can I just go in with my clothes? I guess light. A light raiment, huh? You sure? I figured you for the heavy raiment type. You know, hide behind a skin of steel. No. Hmm. I, I just wear okay. my clothes, my jammies, in fact. Put that on. See if it fits okay. When you're ready for a match, I'll be waiting. You want to fight? You talk to me. All right, then? Yeah! Oh. Guidance Shinji? Who the fuck? Who's Guidance Shinji? The first Arena Blade Master. Oh, Best okay. Best damn warrior that ever lived. Served the Order of Diagna. Got killed fighting the orcs. Azura rest his soul. Mm. Okay, well, uh... Uh... Tell me about the Grand Champion. The reigning Grand Champion is Agranat Gromalog. His fighting name is the Great Prince. He's an orc. Well, half-orc, actually, or so they say. Yeah? The important thing is he's been Grand Champion for nearly a decade. Why? Because nobody's had the guts to face him. The Great Prince is unbeatable. You're on, Sonny. This is what the people of I'll Cyrodiil kill him by the end of the day. Believe. Maybe it's time someone stepped into that arena and proved them wrong. I'm ready for a match. Ready? You call that ready? You're not even wearing your battle raiment. Don't talk to me again until you're suited up, you disrespectful maggot. Ah! <laughs> I love how behind me you can hear someone get punched. Uh, I look like a dork. You can see my gigantic bulge. Damn it, can't zoom in on that. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go kill the Great Prince. Hi. I win. What the? No fair. Nobody claimed it was gonna be a two on one. You haven't run home to mama yet, huh? That's a good sign. So, you ready for a match, or do you just need some information? I'm ready. All right, maggot. 
Looks like you're suited up in your battle raiment and all set to go. Yep. The Red Room is just over there. When you're ready to get a visceral, <coughs> just head up the ramp to the arena. Good luck, and may Azura have mercy on your soul. This is gonna be exciting. I'm going to push people. I'm going to push people so hard. Uh, get ready to see this Good side a lot. Of the Imperial City. Welcome to the arena. For this match, we've got some fresh meat. Two brand new pit dogs. So let's not waste any time. Let the pedal begin! I'll blind him with my skin! Push! Good people! We have a winner! I win! All hail the combatant from the blue team! Victor from the blue team! Leave the arena now and rest! You earned it! Yay! <laughs> it didn't even give me all my magicka back. Hey, did you see that, Owen? Did you see it? I pushed By that guy real good. Divines, you did it. You actually won. You ain't so bad after all, Pip yep, Dog. I pushed him. You may even survive enough matches to advance in rank. Mm hmm. Here, kid. This is your payout for the victory. There's more where that came from if you can keep on winning. Now go unwind before your next fight. Okay, I'm, so you're not a complete loser. Don't get cocky. Let me know when you're ready for a match and you can prove yourself to me some more. Yeah, 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 I'm ready. <laughs> now that's the spirit. You give the people of Cyrodiil a good show and I'll make sure you get a decent <laughs> burial. <laughs> I'm laughing for a completely different reason. You give them a good show. You push that son of a bitch. You can do it. Push that son of a bitch. You got this. Good people of the Imperial Unfortunately, City. you guys don't allow Welcome night matches. To the arena. Who will prevail? The pit dog from the yellow team or the pit dog from the blue team? Let's find out. Lower the gates! Get over here, or I'm gonna fuck you up. Yeah. Good people. We that guy took two pushes. All hail the combatant from the blue team. Victor I did from it. the blue team. Leave the arena now and rest. <laughs> you earned it. Thank you. Okay, so you did it again. <laughs> yep. What do you want from me, a hug? Take your gold and get out of my face, pit dog. The yellow team ain't gonna fight itself, you lazy pit dog. You ready for a match or what? I'm not- I'm the- I'm not taking any breaks, man. I'm ready. You must be downright determined to get yourself killed, huh? Okay, then. A head little. back up to the arena and try not to die before the gate opens. Why didn't it restore your mana? It did. That's the thing, it has a maximum that it restores. If I had to guess, they probably made it so it only restores like 500 at a time. Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. Are you ready for a bloodbath? The winner of this match will advance in rank, so the stakes are high. Pit dogs, show us what you're made of. Oh boy, you're a pit dog too? Here, give me a hug. Give me a hug, you son of a bitch. Good people, we have a winner. All hail the combatant I win. from the blue team. Victor from the blue team, leave the arena now and rest. You earned it. I earned it. I'm, I'm coming out with the net positive, though. I can't believe I'm saying this, but you're no longer a pit dog. That's right. Yep. You've actually advanced in rank. Congratulations, brawler. Yay. 
You know what brawler rank is worth around here? Nothing. Face it, kid. You're still a maggot. You need to keep fighting if you want to be somebody. Ready. Okay, brawler, you know the drill. Head up to that arena and show them <coughs> who's boss. Yeah, they probably, uh, you know, they, they didn't have in mind people modding in items that gave you, like, over, a, uh, over 10,000 magicka. So they probably just thought, yeah, we could just have it restore 500 Good magic and that should be good. City. Welcome to the arena. I got a cursed This amulet. match is a battle of the brawlers. Let your voices be heard as these brave you get warriors it, Pyro. fight you get it. for glory. Combatants, begin! Hmm, weak you are. <laughs> from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the arena now and rest. You earned it. Man, I'm good at my job. <laughs> Four wins is okay, kid, but it don't make you grand champion. Here's your payout. Now go clean yourself up before your next match. I already did. That Raymond's getting a little tight on you, brawler. I think you need some exercise. What do you say? Ready for a match? You're trying to say I'm fat, you son of a bitch? I'll uh, I'll push you. Don't don't tip me. I'll push you. All right, Brawler. This next match is going to be a challenge. Turns out there are two Wood Elf sisters who always fight together. Okay. They're twins, actually. You got to take them both out. Now get in there and show those tree climbers who's boss. Easy. They won't even see me coming. This would be the point where I cast an invisibility spell if I could, but I can't. Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. Can the blue team's brawler possibly hope to defeat the yellow team's wood elf twin sisters? Let's find out. He didn't say lower the gates, assholes. I'm going to push you. Good people. We have a winner. All hail the <laughs> from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. <coughs> Man, when I killed like seven people outside, I actually got a level up. I've killed- I, I think I've killed about seven people now, and I haven't gotten shit. Ha, <laughs> those girls didn't stand a chance. Good job, Brawler. Here's your take. One more match and you'll advance again. Hey. You beating those twins is a good sign. You got a lot of fight in you. Let me know when you're ready to get bloody again. I'm ready. Your next opponent is a Khajiit. Not one of the quick, jumpy ones, either. This cat goes in heavy, Usually with an axe. Now go get him. Oh boy. <laughs> so yeah, do you guys think we're going to make it to Arena Grand Champion by the end of the night? Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. You also the can't so teach someone that doesn't think they can the learn. It's about a healthy balance. Wants it more. <coughs> the yellow team or the blue team? The French Let's version? Find out. Of what? Bring it, you son of a bitch. I'm just warning you. Oh, people, we have a winner. You came at me with a silver oh, battle axe, you son of a bitch. A silver battle axe. I have half a mind. Fuck it. Victor from the blue team, leave the arena now and rest. You earned it. Okay, so you can fight. Your yeah. new title is Bloodletter. You're getting into the real game now, kid. <coughs> more gold for more blood. Don't disappoint me. 
when you can make the uh, the obtainment of knowledge interesting and fun, people do have a tendency to pay more attention. You made it to blood letter, which is more than I can say for most people who step into that arena. Keep it up. The next opponent is a red guard. I've seen him fight with both a mace and a sword. So be ready for either one. I'm wearing light armor. <laughs> be ready for a mace or a sword as though it even makes a difference. <laughs> Change things up a little bit. Bring it on, you son of a bitch. Yeah, I hit you once and then I, I sap you. I push you. Ah. Die. Good people. We have Such a shame a I can't take their weapons. All hail the combatant from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the arena now and rest. You earn it. I like how they got one take for, uh, for, uh, That was a good fight, Bloodletter. You really showed announcer. that red guard who's boss. Here's your take. Now go clean yourself up. The, like, the arena announcer has one take for the, now go clean yourself up. You've earned it. And, and they Come just on, really milk that. Don't lose your momentum now. Keep fighting. I, I ain't taking breaks, man. I'm your ready. next opponent wears a heavy raiment. Okay. but attacks with a short sword. She's like a heavily armored wasp and has the temper to match. Careful. Okay. This doesn't matter to me at all. <coughs> I'm about to level up. Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. You came to watch these two bloodletters do what you, they do best, and they're dying to prove their worth. <laughs> so let the bloodletting begin. Good people, we have There's... a winner. All we don't see that. From the blue team. Victor from the blue team, leave the arena now and rest. You, you believe that these earth. guys are wearing helmets? What use is a helmet? <laughs> like, right? And it just it just hides your hair. That's all it does. Okay, so you killed the Breton. Don't get a big head. Here's your payout. Yeah. My red room got its paint job from fighters like you. After you disemboweled the next idiot. I want you to smear his blood all over the walls. <laughs> okay. If that's what you want. Next up is a dark elf. I've never seen him fight before, but he's got a bow as well as a sword. So be ready for a ranged attack. You think they'd learn they need nipple chapstick at this point? <laughs> The ultimate nipple punch is a completely unguardable attack. It'll push people down to the ground without so much as an ounce of remorse. To the arena. Just look at the yellow team's dark elf. You can see the murder in his eyes. Can the blue team's bloodletter even hope to survive? Let's find out. Oh, nice bow. Ah. Oh. You know what? I'm taking your soul. <laughs> Sorry, man. Oh, never mind. Guess I'm not taking his soul. Are my... Really? Are they... Are they full? Oh, yeah. 
I guess my black soul gems are already full. The combatant huh. from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the arena now. Man, that would have been you fucked up. Can you imagine you sign up for an arena uh for an arena combat and next thing you know you're in a fucking soul gym? Good work, Bloodletter, or should I say Myrmidon? That's right, you've risen in rank. Mermaid. You know how it works. More blood, more gold. Here. All right, Myrmidon. Time to stop messing around. You ready to teach those yellow team scumbags a lesson or what? Sure. Don't be fooled by your next opponent. The little dagger he uses is actually a powerful enchanted weapon called Shimmer Strike. Mm -hmm. Now go get him. Yeah, and I got a staff. I don't even plan to use it. Also, I leveled up. <coughs> Guys, do we do the Ooh, Arena the Grand Champions Imperial quest, or do City. we just take him Welcome on and kill him? To the arena. The yellow team's uh, yeah. combatant has slain That's many like opponents with at. his magical dagger, no, no, no. Shimmer yeah, Strike. Right Let's see if the blue team right can there. end his winning streak. I'm sorry, what? Oh, yeah. Good people, we have a winner. It's only worth 116. <laughs> from the blue team. Victor, from the blue team. Leave the it's a powerful magical rest. weapon Nate, called Shimmer Strike. It's worth 116 gold. <laughs> I guess you told that wood elf what you thought of his magic dagger, huh? <laughs> Here's your gold. Nice going. You're hungry, Myrmidon. I can see it in your eyes. You ready to feed that hunger, huh? You ready for another match? Sure. No surprises with this next one. Just a high elf with a chip on her shoulder. Get up to that arena and make her beg for death. Ah... <coughs> uh. You know, I know it's super repetitive, but there's like a charm to the grand arena, you know? Good yeah, that's why I was asking if Imperial I should City. do that or not. Welcome to the I arena. guess it'll save me some match guy I could just punch him to death. A fight, and a fight you shall have. But talk is for the weak. You want blood. Lower the gates. Hey, get over here, Shunny. I'm gonna whoop. <laughs> I got you. The yellow bar is experience. Uh, so I'm using a mod that uh, gives me uh, that completely revamps the uh, the level up system. So instead of you know. Just using the same ability over and over again in order to gain skills that then transfer to levels, uh, you just get XP. Is he Ultima? They act all high and mighty until you leave them in a pool of their own blood. Here's your gold. Go take a breather. Wait a second, I'm an Ultimer. You're cutting through the yellow team like a knife through scrib jelly. Yeah, it's one more it's fighting worthwhile to worry stress. Around. It's pretty worthwhile to pick up that mod, if anything, just because it makes it so much more bearable. The next opponent is your standard axe-armed orc. He's in a heavy raiment and looks pretty fit. Nothing you can't handle. Oh, boy. I get to kill an orc. I can't remember. Do you even face any mages in the arena, or is it all, like, people with... Swords and shields and shit. City. Welcome to the arena. Everyone loves an advancement match, so let's watch as these two brave Myrmidons face off in a battle. <laughs> I don't to remember either. Death. Combatants to arms. Ah. Good people. We. Winner! All hail the combatant from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the arena now and rest. 
They just tell you about the Prophet Captain, who is uh, the quest giver for the Knights of the Nine Quest There are a few things scarier than an orc with an axe, but you didn't even flinch. Nope. That victory brings you up to warrior rank. Well done. You're a warrior now. That ain't no joke. They may not know your name, but the people out there, the spectators, they know you now. Yeah. They come to this arena to see you. <laughs> That's the guy so who pushes people. people. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've seen the next one fight before. She's a Nord, very quick, very strong. Yeah. She favors a long sword and knows how to use it. Don't underestimate her. Uh huh. I'm go you know what? I'm gonna mix it up and push her a bunch too. Good people of the Imperial City. <coughs> I don't know, Welcome Zara. Maybe. To the arena. Raise your voices in cheer as we lower the gates and these two brave combatants face their destinies. Hi. I'm a pusher. Good people. We have if they winner. don't fall after the first All one, they the fall after the second from one. The blue team. Victor from the blue they don't fall after the second the one. Now they fall after rest. the third one. You earned it. I'm using up like 200 match You match left that in pretty fight. rough shape, warrior. They'll probably have to ship her back to Skyrim in pieces. Nice work. Skyrim! No! Time. Look at you. You keep coming back for more. All right, warrior. You ready for a match? Always. Ah, spellcasters. That's what this next one is. What? A high elf sorceress or something. Just get in close and stab her a few times. That'll teach you. What? Why are you offended over everything that I am? This is so unfair. That was Boot just telling people I'm the prophet originally because he was told not to Good not cloud about it due to Imperial evil forces. City. I don't remember that at Welcome all. to the arena. These warriors want nothing more than to please you. And if they fill their opponents with suffering and pain at the same time, all the better. Hi. Good people. We have a winner. All hail the combatant. I think these guys is worth like 100 XP and it's like, really? Really? I know. Arena now. You earn it. You are not even worth a spot on the yellow team, but you might make a good coaster for my drink. Thanks to the blue team's number one warrior. You really earned your keep this time. Aren't I the only warrior right now? One more match is all you need to advance again, up to gladiator rank. Most combatants never make it that far, but you're the exception, aren't you? We're making good time. Your next opponent is the most savage, blood crazed orc I've ever seen. Yeah. And believe me, I've seen a lot of them. This will not be fun. No, it won't. She'll come out of that gate with a war hammer the size of a child, and she'll swing it until your head explodes. <laughs> Don't let that happen. What if she just came out with a literal child? She was wielding like a fucking stick with a baby tied to it. It's screaming. <laughs> As she swings at you, just ah! Ah! good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. Really this funny. is an important match, for the winner will advance to the esteemed rank of Gladiator. So, without further ado, let the battle begin. <laughs> Ah. Ah. She's got maxed out speed. She's vicious. Good oh, never mind. We have a winner. All hail the combatant from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. She's Leave not a barbarian. She's a pugilist. Rest. You earned it. You hit that orc so hard, her mother in Orsinium started bleeding. That victory advances you to the rank of gladiator. Enjoy the gold. 
gladiator. It's not very often I get to call somebody that. You're doing the blue team proud, kid. Now go kill somebody before I get all weepy. Okay. Listen up. This next match is an outrage, but there's nothing I can do about it. You've got three <coughs> opponents this time, and you have to beat them all. Oh. They're Argonian prisoners brought here from Black Marsh. Oh, they'll die in one day. They've hit. been told they have to kill you in exchange for their freedom. I don't know what crimes they committed, but it's your life or their freedom. The choice should be pretty clear. Get going and watch yourself. Oh man, they're they're gonna die real fast. Yeah, if they're just prisoners, they got what armor and and shanks, prison shanks. Oh, this is gonna be easy. Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. It looks like the yellow team has pulled a fast one by replacing their combatant with three Arconian prisoners. This, this one we should have be interesting. A mysterious stranger. I miss both of those. Good people, we have a winner. All Level twenty three are done from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the what level am I? I'm going up against level 20s. What level am I? Well, it won't tell me because I'm supposed to level up. But I think I'm level 17. The yellow team surprised even me with that match. Three against one. I guess they didn't know who they were dealing with, huh? Well oh. done. You ain't gonna stop until you hit champion, are you? Nope. Well, good. The blue team needs as much glory as we can get. They'll have more wins paralysis dagger because they're all hired from the cartel. That would be awful. I know, I know. Sometimes I wish we'd run the matches through the night too. But the yellow team needs their beauty sleep. <laughs> Damn it, it's too late. Get a move on. No. Okay. And who in Shinji's name might you be? The next Look, grand champion. If you're a spectator, go upstairs and talk to the gatekeeper. This ain't no damned peep show. And oh, I see. So you're an arena combatant. Well, isn't that nice? Now get out of my face. I am gonna push you. Hey, can't you settle this peacefully? Nope. Ah. This ends here. I just can't contain myself. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Owen. Forgive me. <laughs> See, they're fine. I should blow up the save just in case I got a bounty for that. Oh, hey there. Nice to make your acquaintance. I'm, well, my name's not important. Really. <laughs> Every I'm DM. Team. Gladiator rank. Every DM whenever somebody asks, uh, talks to an NPC. My name's, uh, my name's not important. Uh, Farewell. anyways. May your blade always strike true. And first. <laughs> I just want to push all the ugly people, which is everyone. Everyone's uglier than me. Strength 100, yay! Luck 97, yay! Wait, why do... Why did I get so many attribute points? What? What? Uh -huh. Got a lot of attribute points, and I don't know why. Well, I do want to start increasing my speed. Death personality as well. Mm -hmm. Level 18? Well, yeah, but I, I, what's special about level 18? Bam! 
Through steady practice, I have discovered more creatures to summon from the plains of oblivion. I am now an expert in conjuration magic and can cast expert level conjuration spells. Woo. As a new journeyman of illusion, I know what is and isn't real. Like my entire existence, it's not real. It's a video game. For, my god, everything I do is pointless. Anyways, I also know how to fool the minds of my opponents. I can now cast journeyman level illusion spells. Fifty Satan cultism, one giant unarmed bone skeleton with a hundred percent stagger chance. God no. Oh well, I want to increase my blade some. Three points. The ultimate camouflage. I'm gonna increase my mercantile by one. I'm a little bit better at selling things. Whose sword is this? Who left this laying around? Who left this sword just laying around? At least now it's out of the way. Hold on. Yep. We're good. Hit me. Go on. Don't be scared. I can take it. I can take it. I could take it. <laughs> Oblivion. I'm not watching that, Captain. <laughs> ha! Couldn't even hit a stationary target, could you? Hail, friend. I don't believe I've ever seen you down here on the Bloodworks before. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Agranok Gromalag. Most people just call me the Grey Prince. It's kind of silly, I know, but oh, the people that, of Silithil need definitely. heroes. I'm more than happy to <laughs> oblige. Ah, so you're an arena combatant. It's always good to meet a fellow warrior. Especially one who isn't here just to kill the Grand Champion. <laughs> kill the Grand Champion, you say? I'm the reigning Grand Champion of the arena, you see. Once you become a champion, you'll need to challenge me for my title. It's I a fight see. to the death. So if you progress that far and want a shot at the Grand Championship, you'll have to try and kill me. May your blade always strike true. Are you a dark elf? Why are your eyes red? Well met. Whoa, whoa, okay, buddy. I like you as a friend. I like you as a friend. Jeez. You ain't gonna He's stop until you hit champion, are you? standing a barrel next to a guy, and well, he good. immediately thinks he the can undress next to you. The blue team needs as much glory as we can get. We open yet? I know, I know. Damn it. Get a move. It's open. I think it's nine. We just sleep for one hour. You ain't gonna stop. We good? Last match. This one should feel like a vacation. One Khajiit in a heavy raiment, probably with a sword. Nothing you can't handle. Nope. I don't know. He sounds pretty scary. You, you say he's a Khajiit? Oh, man. Khajiit are pretty scary, man. I'm just saying, I don't know if I could take him on. You're like, you know, what if he tries to yiff me or something? Owen. I know you don't believe me. I know you think I'm just some stupid kid who doesn't know what she's talking about. But the truth is the truth. You are my father. One night with a scullery maid is all it takes 
Or maybe your father deserted you too, and never taught you the basic lessons of life? Anyway, the past is long forgotten. What matters now is that you come to terms with the truth. I'm your daughter and I will join the arena as a combatant. Maybe someday when I'm grand champion, you'll see that we have the same blood, the same tenacity. Until that day comes, I'll train every moment of every day. All I want, all I ever wanted, was to make you proud. Your loving daughter, Branwyn. Stop talking already! So she dead, right? How would you feel if you walked up to somebody completely silent and they turned towards you? Eyes wide open, screamed, Those Stop talking already! City. Welcome to the arena. You almost have to feel bad for the yellow team's Kajit. Hello, Kevin. But the blue team's gladiator is a combatant you know and love. Let's see how they I wonder bad. what the point of this is. Yeah, what is this about? Hold on one moment. I said hold on. What is this about? Yeah, what even is this? A dream? From the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the arena now and rest. You earned it. Can't say I'm looting if you can't see it now, can ya? Damn it. You showed that cat whose claws are sharper, eh? I would expect no <laughs> less. Here's your gold. Now go wash up. You look awful. No, you. Got him. What's a gladiator without an arena to fight in? So get up there and start cracking some skulls. Besides, one more fight and you'll advance again. Ooh. The next one's a Breton. He looks like a bit of a dandy, but he's deadly with a blade. He has more experience than you, so be prepared. <laughs> What was that line delivery? He looks like a little bit of a dandy, but he's actually a huge bitch. Now go up there and kill him. <laughs> Whatever. How's it going, dinosaur gummy bear? I am cute. Fair. You're a gummy bear after all. Good people of the Imperial City. Welcome to the arena. You've prayed for it, and these combatants have bled for it. A high stakes Seriously. advancement match. What, Let's what see is who this? What is this supposed to be? To be your new hero. Maybe it's the mechanism. Oh, I don't know. Ooh. Ah. Ooh, he can take some shots. Good people. Damn, dude. We he took a lot. A okay, cool. All hail the combatant from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. It's the drain for blood. The arena now and rest. You just seems so weird because they have the. I, I guess fights will sometimes. By defeating carry that Breton, you've secured your advancement. It's been a long time since I've said this, but congratulations, it's just a weird hero. Looking drain. You're about to face off against the best the yellow team has to offer. Azura knows you're the best the blue team's got. Yep. The first yellow team hero you'll face is an imperial in heavy raiment. He fights with an Akaviri longsword. Mm. Thing is, this guy used to be a blade. You know those guys who protect the emperor? Nope. He's a trained swordsman, so keep your damn head down. Mm. Mm -hmm. So it's hero now, is it? I suppose the little urchin wants to be a champion. Bah. You will never join our ranks. We are gods among mortals. Whatever you say, goat bitch. Know this. If you truly wish to become a champion, you'll have to go through me. If we meet in that arena, I'll make you beg for death. Thank you. I saw your match against the Breton. You're a hero now. I... I'm still in training, but I'll get there too. Anyway, congratulations. Just learn magic, man. It's the most broken thing ever. You just walk Farewell. up to people and push them on the ground and they die. I sincerely believe her words. What do you believe about them?
good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. Behold, as two heroes meet in the fighting pit for an epic battle worthy of song, combatants, begin! Oh, well, they deaf don't sound like Christopher Walken. <laughs> I guess. guess so. Ah, supposed to be impressed. Man, the bread was tougher than you. We have a winner. All hail the combatant from the blue team. Victor from the blue team. Leave the arena now and rest. Yes. You earned it. <laughs> Bonk. Gotta regain that magic. Defeating an arena hero is one thing. Jesus, Duke. But defeating a former <laughs> member of the Blades? You must be blessed by the divines or something, my friend. You're a hero, my friend. That crowd is out there for one reason, to see you destroy the yellow team. Now go give them what they want. Okay. Okay, hero. This next opponent is a high elf wizard. A master in the school of destruction. Oh, is but he wait, really a master? He, worse. he also uses an enchanted shield called the Grey Ages, which gives him some serious magic resistances. Your best bet is to just charge straight in. But but is he Press really the attack? And don't give him a chance to let off a spell. I don't want to have to sweep your ashes out of the arena. But is he actually a master of destruction? Because I You think they would have heard of me? You'd think they would be like, and in this corner we have the Archmage from the Wizards. Hold on, why? Good people and I'm just like, of the hi. City. Welcome to the arena. Put your hands and your voices together for the two brave heroes who have come to rock the very foundations of this arena. Probably, Lower Zara. Probably. Gates. Could be a problem. He is actually resistant. Um, don't worry, I can summon a skeleton. Summon the skeleton. <laughs> You'll never leave this arena. You're Other weapons do I have? You're a traitor to your own race. Let's get this over with. Yep, he's just completely resistant. This is a this is a time. Good thing I've been training my sword as well. Wow, this thing's actually worth a lot of money. It's a shame I can't take it. From the blue team, leave the arena now and rest. You earned it. Damn. That dude countered my entire strategy. He was ready. He knew what was up. He was like, that son of a bitch, he's going to try and kill me with his single spell kill. Well, I won't allow him. I'll use my special. I'll be honest, hero. 
With the kinds of victories you've been having, I knew that elf didn't stand a chance. Here's no, your it was an elf. Yeah, the yeah he explained the shield gave him magic resist. And apparently, it's like a hundred percent magic resist. I didn't know that. You're at the end of a long road, hero. This is the last time you'll face off against the yellow team before being named champion. Yay! Go up to that arena and make sure the people of Cyrodiil never forget that it was you who brought the yellow team to its knees. All right, this is it. Your last fight against the yellow team. I guess you could say they saved the best for last. The three best, actually. Oh. You're up against a swordsman, an archer, and a spellcaster. <coughs> Two lower level combatants, plus that yellow team champion you've seen down here. Oh. You beat all three and you get named champion. I know you can do this. Now get up there and show everyone why you're the best. Uh, oh wait, there's one more thing. I sent Pork Chop the Boar up to the arena to help mm. you out. He'll at least keep one of them distracted. Now, good luck. Hell yeah, we got Pork Chop. Uh, and to answer your question, Zara, uh, Magic Resist trumps my uh, my fire vulnerability spell. I saw your mat. Farewell, my friend. May your blade always strike true. So even if I did hit him with it, it would have just been absorbed. Or fizzled, or whatever you want to call it. Good people of the or... Imperial City, welcome to the arena. I give you the Blue Team, oh. and this brave combatant <laughs> defeat three opponents and become the next champion. Oh. Let's find out. Yeah, let's do this. Ow. <laughs> it's a protection staff. Yeah, one of the mods gave me a uh, uh, added cool little staffs that you can use as shields. It's pretty cool. That would take too much time, Captain. I'm a busy man. What is it? You did it. You beat him every <laughs> last one. Do you know how long it will take for the yellow team to recover from this? <laughs> A long time. My friend, it is with great honor that I advance you to the rank of champion. You've done it. You've shown them all. You're the best. Well, almost the best. You're done competing in normal arena matches, but there's still the grand champion. Huh? Kid, you've got more guts and skill. I think you can take the great prince. Go over and talk to Isabel if you think I'm right. Agreement. By Shinji, you did it. You beat them all. You're a champion. My friend, you have brought honor to the blue team in ways I can't even describe. In ways you could never do. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I insult you? Ugly. Farewell, my friend. You're that new champion, right? Yep. The mm. one you just yelled at I yesterday. I guess I know why you're here. But let me tell you, you're making a big mistake. The Your Grey Prince is the best fighter mistake. the arena has ever seen. He can't be beaten, not by you. But hey, it's your right. Damn straight it is. If you want to challenge Agranac, go right ahead. He lives down here in the Bloodworks. Do that. Come talk to me again and I'll arrange your match. Okay. Well... What are you waiting for? Hey, dude, you want ah, fight? so you've returned. Come at last to challenge me for my grand champion title. Yeah. Yeah, I wish to challenge you. As I expected, I accept your challenge. Speak to Isabel and let her know when you're ready, and I shall make for the arena. Shinji be with us both. 
Sorry, friend, but we've got nothing more to talk about. Oh. So you've actually challenged the Grey Prince? Yeah, I Do went over really and talked to him. you know what you've gotten yourself into? Oh. Agronag Gromalog is the best fighter ever to step into an arena. He can't be beaten, not by you. But if you want to fight him, that's your right. Mm-hmm. Well, you know the drill. You let me know when you're ready for a match, and Agronak will head up to the arena and prepare for your arrival. Just make sure you understand our rules of competition for this match. Fighting the Grand Champion, well... The rules are a bit different. Okay. How so? Okay, listen up. There are no disqualifications in a Grand Champion match. That means you can wear whatever armor you damn well please. Oh, nice. Agronak will be wearing his raiment of valor, and he's probably got it heavily enchanted. So feel free to do the same to any armor you have. Now, as you know, in any standard arena match, you're forbidden <laughs> from looting the corpse of a fallen opponent. Well, this ain't any standard match. Mm. In the event that you beat the Grey Prince, you're to remove his armor and present it to me. Then you'll get your own raiment of valor. Hmm. Well, what are you waiting for? Sorry, friend. Okay. Then I shall get dressed for the occasion. There we go. I'm ready. So you've actually agreed. I'm so ready. you're ready to fight the Grey Prince, are you? Well, you can't go out there without a I'll name. Save. You know, an arena name. I'll save. Something catchy. Something the people of Cyrodiil will remember when they tell stories about your inglorious defeat. Boot. So what's it gonna be? I wish to be called Boot. 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 I guess Sir Slaughter. Or actually, the Tamriel Terror is pretty. Uh, it's pretty accurate given our character. Boot Skittles, the Tamriel Terror. Yeah. The Tamriel Terror, huh? I like it. Yeah, that'll do nicely. All right. It's time to see if you're crazy good or just plain crazy. The Grey Prince is headed up to the arena as we speak. Go up there and meet him, one champion to the next. May the Divines have mercy on your soul. Yeah, it's gonna be easy. Well, what are you waiting for? Get. We didn't have a chance to talk to him about uh, discovering his past. Because we didn't leave the arena, I believe. But that's fine. Good people of Cyrodiil! Welcome to the Imperial City Arena! Believe it or not, someone has actually challenged the young Vito. I mean, we're just gonna arena push him, so whatever. Champion. But who, you might ask, could possibly be brave enough to face such a fearless foe? Who could wrest the title from our fame? Grey Prince! Good people! He really I does seem like a nice guy. The team's latest champion! A Very warrior sad. of skill, strength, and determination! Behold the Tamriel Terror! Hi! Why'd you guys boo me? Lords and ladies, citizens of the Empire, I give you the Battle of I read the that ages. as <laughs> I read that as man, all these combatants Steal have big penises. <laughs> Miss Pyra. I was like, gates. what? Bring it! We shall do battle in here where no one can see. Oh. Huh. Good people! You have just been Oh whoops. I, I cut him off. His shield fell Behold, through. The new hero of the people of Cyrodiil. Behold, your arena grand champion, the Tamriel Terror. 
esteemed grand champion. You may leave the arena now. Save Reload. Them. Reload so we can actually hear what they say. I guess, sure, we can do that. I mean, it was only two zaps to kill him. And also, oh, I, it gives me a chance to get that shield. Deal. Welcome to the Imperial City Arena! Believe it or not, someone has actually challenged the unbeatable Arena Grand Champion! But who, you might ask, could possibly be brave enough to face such a fearless foe? Who could wrest the title from our famed Grey Prince? Good Is it me? People, I give you the blue team's latest champion, a warrior of skill, strength, and determination. Is it me? Behold the Tamriel Terror! Uh, you hold Q. Lords and Then ladies, you rotate around yourself. Citizens of the Empire, I give you the Battle of the Ages. Combatants, steal yourselves. Lower! Gates. Oh. Damn it, it fell through again. Oh well. Fuck, and I, I did the same thing. Whatever. I'm done. I'm tired. What is this? It's a pretty nice looking sword. El Hazen Saber. El Heisen Saber. It weighs a lot. It tires my wee little hands. Behold, the new hero of the people of Cyrodiil. Behold, your arena you. grand Lick my champion, balls. the Tamriel Terror. Esteemed grand champion, you may leave the arena now. See the blade master to receive your winning. By the love of Shinji, you did it! You beat the Grey Prince! This <laughs> This is unbelievable. Yep, he that wasn't makes you the ready best fighter the arena punching. has ever seen. You've got Agranax Raymond of Valor. Good. Give it to me. Alright. Now I give you your own. By Shinji, I, I I'm shaking. This is amazing. Okay, do. Do you want a heavy raiment of valor or a light raiment of valor? Your choice. Light. Right. Okay. It is with great honor that I present to you this gold and the esteemed raiment of valor and name you the new arena grand champion. Cool. You've done it. The Grey Prince was a <coughs> great orc, rest his soul and all that. But you beat him. <laughs> yep, I, I punched his now nipples go. real good. Take some time to rest. When you're feeling up to it, come talk to me again and we'll discuss your future. This thing sucks. Oh, by the way, you guys can have your, uh, your shitty armor back. Hello, my friend. What can this grizzled old blade master do for you? My my cue switches to third person. I may have changed up my controls a little. You might just want to go into your control scheme. Ready? Ready for what? You're grand champion. You've already won it all. The whole damn thing. <laughs> <laughs> Get a move on. I couldn't see it, but that was me pantomiming, just reaching into his mouth and grabbing his tongue. You... you killed Agronak. The Grey Prince is dead. He was my friend. My mentor. Congratulations, Grand Champion. Hope it was worth it. It was. It really was. It's pretty nice. Thanks. <laughs> There's the new Arena Grand Champion. Now listen, I bet you're wondering what's next, I never eh? got the Agronach Well, quest. I've been thinking. Because <laughs> I killed him too Why fast. Why not spice things up Or I, I chose Give to the just the people of Cyrodiil what they really him. want. We revise the rules of competition, offer a new kind match. 
I'm talking weekly shows, fights, pitting you against... Are you ready for this? Monsters. And maybe even people some wild are. animals. Yeah. Sounds great, doesn't it? I've had some people out collecting your new combatants. The wilderness is full of them. Let me know when you're ready for a match and it's showtime. Wait, you've had them col... I literally just won. Did you expect me to win? Just, I'm just saying, like, she said she's had people collecting monsters. And I only now won. What? Yeah, I'm ready for a match. Looks like you've reached your peak. Tell you what, from here on in, you can fight one, two, or three Minotaur Lords. So what's it gonna be? I'm ready for three, baby. You've got it. I'll have the three Minotaur Lords brought out to the arena. Now get up there and give the people what they paid for. Her people apparently caught three Minotaur Lords within, like, a fucking fraction of a second of me becoming Grand Champion. Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. You come to watch the Grand Champion battle some of Cyrenil's fiercest creatures. I'm Who hiding will behind the wall. This week's epic battle of combatant versus beast. Let's find out. Lower the gate! Uh, who are you? Little bitch boys, that's what. Yeah, you can't hit me. Bam! Yeah, oh, you. Ah. Ow! Ah, their, their reach is bullshit. Good people. I, I, I can't grab their uh, mid or their uh, hammers because they're too heavy. They're only worth 800 though, so you know, whatever. Cyber demons and doom. Fair enough, I guess. Yeah, one. Great show, great show. You really gold. brought Hell down yeah. the house. Here's your gold. Now get some rest, and I'll see you next week. They just set up Elder Scrolls dimension doors that activate on command, set up by the hunters. Ah, another happy spectator. You, of course, want to bet on a fight. Who will it be? I... I... Oh, sorry. I, I just assumed. Well, if there's anything else do... I can do for you, please just ask. Do you not recognize me? Have a good day now. Where is he? Where is he? What? Stop right there, criminal scum! Nobody. What? Wait, what? What? What did I. D what? He killed. He killed the grand champion! Arrest him! What the fuck happened? What kind of bullshit? Who did I. You pants a guard? Maybe. Just gonna pay the gold. Here's the procedure. Yeah. Here's the procedure. We take your hey, money. Hey, good citizen. How can I be of service? Hey, my... It's my little white tiger. What is it, citizen? Do I have any, uh, boar meat for ya? I do. You have my ear, citizen. Eat that. All's quiet, eh? Did he eat it or did it just fall through the ground? Well, I just got a bunch of money from, uh, killing three mentors and then immediately lost it because I was falsely accused of murder, I guess. Right? That's basically what just happened. I, I don't know why I was expected to pay, like, a thousand gold for something. I don't know. 
I'm gonna bet on a ah, match. Ah, another happy... All right, then. The blue team... All right, my friend. You've got... Welcome. Welcome to the arena. Go on, rip the buddy throat out, you useless pansy. Huh? What? Can't you say I'm watching this? What do you want? Good the citizens. This is all so grisly and horrible, isn't it? The blood and bodies. But I've won so much money, I can't stop betting. I think I need help. <laughs> yeah, you do. Oh, let me at him. Let me at him. I'll, I'll zap him real hand. fast. It'll it's be lickety team split. Versus the yellow team in a battle. To the death! Oh. The gates! Death? Who's gonna win? She she's fighting with fists. He's got a hammer. I think he's won. <laughs> Don't you know never go fist build, you fool? You need some fucking magic to pull that shit. Oh, he he knows spells too. I win. You won. <laughs> you won. Good job. You won. Hey, there he is. Wow, you're the grand champion. I saw your fight against the Grey Prince. You're the best. Can I can I follow you around? I won't get in the way. The bitch monk we killed in the Black Temple? In the Black... T what? Who? Are we talking about... Are we talking about the D&D &D game? Oh, okay. Yeah. Follow... Follow your esteemed grand champion! Golly, you're the best! I'm going to follow you and watch you and worship the ground you walk on. Let's go. Yes, oh great and mighty grand champion. Is there something you need? Can I carry your weapon? Shine your boots? Back rub, perhaps? Hmm. Those all sound good. God. But I'm good. Adoring fan, kill this man. You're useless. Ah! Oh, no. To the market. We gotta sell some stuff. <laughs> he was always Boots number one fanboy. He just didn't know who I was until I became the grand champion. But it was always meant to be. I Let's did. be real. Oh, shit. I almost forgot. Nipple touch. I gotta touch people's nipples so they like me, you know? Otherwise, what do I have in life? <laughs> Nothing. Hey! This is Feel my protege. To... What can I interest you in? It only lasts for one second. I... Fare thee well. Feel free. Well, have a look around. There we go. This is my protege. You, he's really something. He's really something. Anyways, uh, ebony dagger. There you go. This. And that's all your money. There. Hi. <laughs> I feel like this is illegal. Nah. Good day. Have a look at my wares. Nothing's sure illegal when you're the arena grand champion. That's a good. That's. That's. That seems a fair price. Damn skippy it is. You better remember that. Here's some a books.
You drive a hard bargain. Damn skippy, I do. Thank you for the raid of 19. What were you up to? This is a big raid. Hi there. You ever Boot welcomes you as well. Hello there. Hello there, raiders. I have been awaiting you. <laughs> you know, I, I should become a, a, a VTuber. And I should have whoever... Uh, whoever creates it, just create Boot here. Just, just make Boot Skittles, and I will, I will become Boot. I will become my horrible monstrosity. <laughs> I love him. Uh, so what were you up to, Bolero? What were you playing? Oh, hello. Ha! We're fine. My name is Methrodel. I've come to the Imperial City to make my fortunes. You won't get anything here, idiot. Good day. Do we massacre everyone? Not yet. Later. Later. Look at Another the muscles time. on you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she said, look at all the muscles on you. I was like... Muscles? The fuck are you? Oh, right. I guess I do have muscles, don't I? It's crazy, I know. Um, I need to spend some time in jail so that I can join the Thieves' Guild. But what do we do next? Do we join the Fighters' Guild or do... Ooh, what do we do next? What to do next? I guess we could do Fighters' Guild. Because it's going to be fairly straightforward, just like the Mages' Guild. We can also do a little bit of exploration instead. Maybe do some, I don't know, side quests. Oh, you know what? Uh, that is one thing that I forgot. Um, Frost Crag Spire. I forgot that I said that I wasn't going to go unlock it until we unlocked the, or until we became the uh, Mage Guild champion. Yeah, you have to spend some time in jail to join the major skills. Because then someone is like, Ah, you're a criminal just like me. We're both criminals. And it's like, dude, I only stole like five gold. I was in there for like an hour. <laughs> I've been in here for like 45 minutes. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can do that, can't I? Eh, never mind. I'll just do that then. I've always joined the Thieves' Guild by going to jail. But, yeah, I guess, uh... I guess I'll, I'll I'll just do that then. Does it have to be won by the docks, or can you just charm any... Hold on. <coughs> oh, whoops. There we go. I descended a little bit. Gotta, gotta correct this. Come on, damn you! Come on! I think docks. Uh, I know for a fact. As soon as I go to the docks, the entire game's gonna break. I'm gonna have to re restart it. What the? What are you doing up here, little? Hey, he's gone! You can tell that was put in by a mod. Yeah, that's definitely put in by a mod. No person in their right mind would just pile on a bunch of rocks like that. Disappearing gobby. I'd be terrified if 
if uh, there were like ethereal goblins. <laughs> That's that sounds like a that sounds like a fit like a punk fantasy band. Hello, everybody. We're the ethereal goblins, and we're here in order to, in order to play the pan pipes and the guitar. I could see the spire up there. I just don't know how to get. To I think I have to. I think I'm gonna have to come back over here. I think I'm on the low side. And I need to start up on the high side. <coughs> come on, damn you! Come on. Why? Oh wait. I forgot the most important reason why you get a horse. So you can run up the side of cliffs. Oh! Don't worry, I killed a goblin skirmisher. Good job, me. I did that totally by myself. Knoll Mountain? What? Who the fuck's been camping at the base of my property? My venison. They, they just left a bunch of fucking meat all over the place, didn't they? That sounds like a band name, Max Mess. <coughs> Look, there it is. The great spire known as Frost Crag. I finally found you. My spire. I've arrived at Frostcrack Spire. I should make my way inside this curious but extraordinary tower. Why couldn't it have been shaped like my face, damn it? That'd be awesome if they programmed a, uh, a building that's uh, shaped like your face. I've discovered a, a dusty tome within Frostcrag Spire. I should read it to learn more about this unusual structure. After reading the dusty tome as soon as I opened it, I've learned that I can purchase everything I need to restore the place to its former glory from Aurelian Way at the Mystic Emporium, the market district of the Imperial City. Oh boy, elevators. Man, remember when... That is how you make an entrance. That is how you impress a person into going, Wow, this place is so cool! This place is so dumb diddly delicious. Right, this is the only way to get alchemical ingredients from uh, Oblivion. Uh, after you've shut all of the portals, I believe. Well, that, not entirely true. I believe some of these uh, will hang out outside of portal locations, but for the most part, yeah. This is like the only way. It's a nice garden.
However, what they lack is uh, magical components from uh, from the Shivering Isles. Which I think we'll do the Shivering Isles last because that is the best DLC. Actually, oh goodness. I, I, I was about to say, I think that's... Yeah, I, I would say so. I think... I think Shivering Isles is the best DLC that, uh, that, uh, Bethesda ever created. I don't know, uh, give me some thoughts, opinions. Is Shivering Isles their best DLC ever? Oh, turn it. Free XP. I don't know. Have you never played Shivering Isles before, Captain? This is my room? No, it's just up here. Alright, the Suicide Tower. Hold on. Okay, cool. Yeah! You'd say the vampire one in Skyrim is the best? I definitely think it's high up there. But I don't think it's the best. Hey, dolphin. Yes! Oh. Oh. Damn it! Damn it! He knew! Okay, you get to live this time, kid. Also, uh, uh, Dolphin, you'll be happy to learn that we, uh, that I figured out what was the wrong with the Manny Marco mod. It's that, uh, I feel so stupid for this. One of the, uh, so it comes in a bundle of three mods. Um, and you're supposed to have all of them active. I only had one active. And that was the problem. Now, that being said... We then encountered a different problem in that uh, the game would uh, the game crashed no matter what after we killed him. So you know, basically nothing changed. But we did do the fight at the beginning of this uh, this stream, and we won like badasses. Ladle, 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 ladle. L win some, lose some with mods. Yeah, basically. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's an issue that they've known of. In, in fact, that's one, uh, that's why one of the three files exists. Because it's supposed to fix that problem, but unfortunately it didn't. So I was like, well, okay. Fellow Magister, may I speak with you? No. I don't know why I'm just kind of running. I, I'm just kind of fumbling about for some reason. I don't know why I'm going this way either. As your uh, newly appointed uh, well met, Grand well Wizard well or whatever, I get to do whatever I want to you. So get over here. Touch. Yes. Yes. Mm, yes. Yes. <laughs> now beat it. Greetings, Guildmate. It's been about four hours today just getting Stalker on Steam to work with Steam Controller. Oof. I, I'm i amazed that you even went through that, uh... Uh... Through the process of dealing with that. I remember I, I played Stalker on stream quite a while ago. And, uh... Yeah, no, it's a... Is such a good game. It is such a good trilogy of games. Literally, like, uh, Tucker and I, we rave about how good Stalker is. I, I think the games that Tucker and I rave about are Stalker and, uh, 
Hmm. What other games do we rave about? <laughs> Stalker is the big one. I rave about Metro uh, 1 and 2. Not the third one. I actually... I actually am one of the uh, one of the people that hates Metro Exodus, and uh, a lot of Metro fans can understand why. And uh, Tucker put it in a way that made a lot of sense. It's like the way he put it. You know, keep up with me on this one. Keep up with me. Imagine if you were playing Fallout, and then uh, as you're just walking along the beach. A Chinese yacht pulls up next to you, and they go, "What? What, what the? F what the fuck is? What is going on here? Why are you living in such squalid conditions? The rest of the world is completely fine. Like, what? Why are you living like this? Why don't you go ahead? <laughs> and then you jump on the yacht and you go explore, literally anywhere else. And that's basically Metro Exodus." Just a simple matter of DLing a community patch, adding Stalker to Steam library a second time, then recreating the shortcut from Steam. Easy peasy, basically self-explanatory. I that is still far too much for me to deal with. Plus, I I did learn how to play it with uh, controller and mouse, so you know, it's not too bad. Oh, I don't want any of that. I don't think about it. No. You get shield ten percent on this brown shirt. <laughs> Could make some suicide shoes. You know, just some shoes that you put on to kill yourself, you know, it's always an option. It's my pleasure. Please continue. It was like a SpongeBob SquarePants episode where the announcer says 20 hours later. For you, of course. Wait. Farewell. Wait. You used to have spells for purchase. I'm at your service, what, Archmage. What what's happened? Why why won't you teach me spells anymore? He's like, you're the Archmage now. What more could I teach you? And it's like a lie. I could learn a lot. You know what? This is a thing we could do. We did. We never. Uh, we never joined the uh, the uh, fraternity. How can I serve you, brother? Ah, I don't think you could. Oh wait, yeah. You We're looking for recruits. Interested? Yes. You are welcome here anytime, my friend. Fraternity. Most of the time, they lounge around the tavern drinking. Making up stories of epic battles with impossible odds that they won. Have uh, a look around. Uh, is you that won't what find we do here? Prices in all Tamriel. Is that all we do here? Because I've actually won big battles. What? I'm now a member of the Umquat Om fraternity. Does that do anything for me? I don't think that does anything for me. Why did I join you? How can I? Most. Good day. I'm going up here, and there's nothing you could do to stop me. This is just the mages' quarters. This is just a copy pasta of the mages' quarters. I'm angry. It even has the bowl of strawberries. You can't hide shit from me, dog. You can't hide shit from me, dog. Wiggles is barking at me. She's like, yo, bitch, take me out. Silly. Silly, dog. Get rid of the jumbo potatoes. Those belong to me. Here we 
go. Pumpkin Atronach. A pumpkin Atronach. Hmm. All my stuff is still in here. Sweet. I thought I had a, uh, oh, there it is. I got a gold nugget. Do I have three pumpkins? That's the next question. B C D E F G H I J K L M N O. Damn it! I only have two pumpkins. Two pumpkins! Damn it! Guys, uh, Von Richten's Guide to Ravenloft comes out tomorrow, or I guess today now. Yes! Yes! God, yes! Von Richten's Guide to Ravenloft! Yes! Yes! Yes, you... Yes! 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 God, I love you! Yes! Von Richten's Guide to Ravenloft! Wiggles! Yes! Yes! It comes out! It comes out, Wiggles! It comes out! Do you understand? Do you understand, Wiggles? Do you understand? Pretty sure the lineages they showed off removed the double creature types ideas. It doesn't surprise me. <coughs> Primarily because it adds far too much complication to the game. But, I don't know. We'll, we'll see in the official format. But I, I can't imagine them thinking that it would add too much complication to the game. It would also avoid uh, unnecessary conflict. Why are you guys still closed? Because unfortunately, there's a lot of traditionalist players out there that go, "Well, one of my one of my ideals is that I do not accept undead in this world, and you are unfortunately a type of undead, so I must kill you." It's like, just don't be a dick. Antus Vannon, retired. Sleep late and read trashy books. Ah. I don't keep up with the Major's Guild affairs anymore. I see you too are a fan of the Lusty Argonian Maid. Daedra Shrines. I can think of three. The Hersheen Shrine is south of town, northeast of Breville, between the Upper Nibbon and the Green Road. The Mephala Shrine is northeast of the junction of the Red Ring Road and the Silver Road. <coughs> I've heard there's a Veramina Shrine at the headwaters of the Reed River, though I've never been there myself. I know, um... Oh, that is another thing. There's also the, um... The, uh... Fallen, pa it's not Fallen Paladin, it's uh, Oathbreaker Paladin. The Oathbreaker Paladin gets the ability to just control uh, an undead. Goodbye. You know, and unfortunately, um, you know, with their Adventurers League, they have this issue of, um, they kind of correct things as they go. And... and Edgar Votrine. They need to just you have don't want general. The very best. You want like, cheap. You can't do this cheap. rules. They need to have general. You can't do this rule. Uh, you know, so controlling other players should just be a thing that players should business. not be allowed to do. At least for Adventures League. Hmm. Hmm. 
These really are discount spells. They suck ass. Thank you for Can revealing I interest you? the world of suckage to me. I could buy this. I won't. You know what? Would you, would you like... You might just take all my scrolls from me. Hold on, hold on. Let me touch your nipple real fast. You too. Edgar Have okay. a look around. Now, you find uh, better prices yeah, you can just all... have all my scrolls. I don't care about them. That seems a good price. That's more than. That's a. F How much are you giving me? Twenty-eight percent, about thirty. I'll, That's I'll, more. I'm fine with that. A good. A fine. An excellent bar. There we go. A pleasure. You too. Yeah. I want in the Mystic Emporium. Open up the Mystic Emporium. I want in. I want in. Let me in. Let me in. I've been waiting since morning. I help me, help me, sir, help me. I wonder what's inside this building. <laughs> Nothing. Damn it. I hate when I accidentally do this. Sir! Fire help me! Stools. Help me! Nice house. I have a little income. Quite comfortable. The time is light on my hands. Yeah, your life is great, but you understand I'm stuck in the wall! Help! Good day. <laughs> Thank you, Fast Travel. Cheap spells. Edgar's is the place to look. Seems to me some things are worth paying full price for. Nah. Yes? Farewell. I want inside the Mystic Emporium. Eh, consider I'll just, themselves to be more civil. Guess I'll just come back another time. Maybe. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Yes. I mean, yeah, they, they should absolutely make it so that you are affected by both types. But I think what they're trying to avoid is, uh... Be, because if you think about it, being able to be... Or being affected by... Spells or effects or whatever that affect multiple... I hope I can... Uh... Creature... Uh, yeah, creature types. Uh, is... Unfortunately... Fortunately, uh, yeah, it's kind of a nerf. <laughs> Let's do business. Hands of the Atronach. I don't care. Yeah, I'm just kind of here for, uh... You, uh... Let's do business. Huh. This is actually pretty worthwhile for me to grab real fast. Hmm. 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 I I should grab that. <laughs> hey. 
Bye. I forgot to charm him I first. I hope I can help. Yeah, you guys are were supposed to be open like sure a while ago. So I just let myself in. Imagine that. Anyways, I just want to buy this stuff. You drive a home. Who bought them? Come back. Goodbye. A pleasure to be sick. Well met. Is that I offer all? the finest goods and lowest prices in all Syracuse. Oh, right. There's the candle boxes. Right. You too. I'll be back. You just watch. I'll be back. I forgot about the mage boxes. Because uh, the Frostcrag Spire has uh, enchanting thing. An enchanting altar and a uh, spell making altar. I, I, I'm gonna go to the. Uh, I'm gonna go to the. Dock District. The slums. Yeah, that's what it's called, right? Have my ear, citizen. Consider the Fighters Guild. I hear they're always looking for recruits. <coughs> Hell. Don't tempt me. I'll join the Fighters Guild. I'll do it. Speak. Oh. What? Quick save. Gonna quick load real fast. Gonna see if that help things. I know a quest we can do. Still just walking around with that what the fuck mesh, huh? <laughs> that dude living so last season, am I right? <laughs> uh, what is scrub? Nope, there it goes. I was waiting for it to crash. Whenever I go to the dock district, it always crashes. <laughs> but then it stabilizes after the crash, so I'm not exactly sure. Or it tends to stabilize after the crash. Hopefully. Hopefully. Good thing, good thing about the Hollow One gift is that unlike the Gothic UA, the Wern specifically states that ye aren't considered undead creature type-wise. You're just considered undead to spells that only sense undead, so you can't turn undead them. Mm. That's a yeah, that's a pretty good way of going about it. <coughs> when does Von Richten's Guide fully release? Is it like at noon? Is it at noon? Uh. What would that be? Uh, Pacific time? Hi there. Those who live by no, whatever in the world could be could a decrepit old man do for someone as young as yourself? Have you seen my age, Slider? How old could you be? Haha, <laughs> I remember you the old septum when he was just a boy. That's how old. That's alright, I've led a full life, gone on many adventures, so when the time comes for me to go, I'll be ready. In the end, death is but a new adventure we must all experience. Yeah, I don't uh I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that at all. This is my home. Sit in that chair. And think about what you've done. Uh, the little trinkets I've gathered over my time. I got all these keys. Well, they don't weigh anything. I really need to get that fucking keychain mod work. 
working. I really need to get that thing working. Yeah. We can carry three staffs with us, that's fine. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go touch someone's nipple. You, you're poor, right? Yes. Perfect. Good day. Well met. Nah, you're... Farewell. I'm pretty sure he's a part of the Thieves' Guild. Go ahead, please. What are you wearing? You too. What does this accomplish for you know what? Never mind. Might be out now. I'm just gonna uh, I'm gonna try and get myself just a PDF version that is not locked to a specific like account or something. What? What? I have potions and everything you need to make your own. What will it be? You do not have potions. You are a liar and a cheat, and I hope you die. Bye. Good day. How are you? There's boxes above my head. I think I've been in here. Let's see how it looks in the Black Rook Tavern. Wow, it's the same as any other place. What do you want? What can I interest you in? Mmm, bowls of mutton stew. Farewell. It's still pre-order? Okay, so it probably will release at about... Probably about noon Pacific time. Where's all the poor people? The fuck is... What is this? It's just a destroyed house. Huh. They didn't have the decency to destroy the rest of it, huh? Waterfront smithy. Hey, Bugaboo. How's it going? Yo, how's it going? Duty calls. Why on earth would you put a cemetery next to the water? That's a dumb idea. That's fucking stupid. That's how you contaminate your water source. You dumb idiots. Chapel of Kinnereth. Also, why is there just a fog on the ground? That's a stupid thing. You mods, you, you mod creators are dumb. Learned warlock. What? They're poor. They don't know better. The city is the people that takes care of that. Hiding citizen. Wow, you got a fucking wizard's hat. You're an expert, aren't you? What? What? What are you looking at? I'm not looking at anything. I just... You're looking at my hat, aren't you? What? No, I just... You think it's stupid, don't you? Yes? No. Uh, it's great, honest. You don't think that. You're lying. I know it. Don't lie to me. I really think it's a nice hat. I don't believe you, but I'll let you off this once. Don't let me see you staring at my hat again, or I'll turn you into a hawker. Also, don't look at my... What is clearly wooden beard. It moves with my head. Only qual... Sarmain Staff. Staff of Banishment? Acrobat's Amulet. Amulet of Axes. Elemental ring, flame ring, and the treachery. <laughs> Ooh, he sells sorcerer's hats. Hmm. Hmm. Guys, do we buy a sorcerer's hat? 
Maybe he wants to buy a better burial ground for him other than near the water. Well, you should have thought about that long before. <coughs> Get the hat? Yes. Now, I don't know what TRA stands for, so let's just go with the T. Master Alembic. Hey, sells so black soul gems. Cool. Another satisfied customer. Sure. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> they did put down the fucking hair. They did put down the hair so my hair just stabs right through. This is stupid and I love it. <laughs> uh, I'm going to quick save and fucking execute you. So I can drag you around by your beard. Come on, ah! She has spell reflection! Ah, I'm being attacked by... I got attacked by a tiny person! That was terrifying! <laughs> Look, his beard moves with him. <laughs> you guys are dumb. Ah. We're ready to go find the Wizard of Oz. He has a key. Oh my goodness. I excuse me, are you alright? I. I the divines. It's all over! What? Uh. I love how the fucking, uh, the fucking burial man came and showed up. <laughs> you see what I did right there, kid? That's what we call murder. And it's not cool, unless I do it. What are these, wands? These are stupid potion bottles. They just stab you. Nine K gold. Hey, take whatever you want. It's none of my business. Yeah, that's what I thought, bitch. <laughs> Anyways, let's load up that save. I want to kill him. Oh, <laughs> game crashed. The game was like, "Nah, you can't just take that back. You can't take that back without a full restart, bitch." He loves you. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Time people be scary. They are! They are. I love them, but they're terrifying. The game doesn't like you killing Gandalf, apparently. Oh, wait, come on, bro. Come on. You kill. You killed Gandalf? You killed Wooden Beard Gandalf? Okay, who are you? Salutations to you. How can I serve you on this fine day? You work here? I do, along with my husband, Sarmain. We run this small magical imp Your husband? We sell out chemical ingredients and apparatus, magical robes and staves and a wide ver- This person had a, uh, a fucking fetish for standing blowjobs. Must apologize for my husband's mood. He's gotten a little grumpy as of late. Your husband? That's right. Why do you look so surprised? Are you a little young for him? Young, bless you, child, you've made my day. But I'm not young, I'm 87 years old. Yeah, that's, um, this is a lolly complex. That's what this is. This is a lolly complex. You, you can't fucking fool me. <laughs> you can't fool me, modder, mod. You can't fool me, mod creator. I know what you're into. Fucking, she looks 12, but she's actually 10,000 years old, because she's a vampire. I know what you're into, you monster heathen! Anyways, what, how, how is that possible? A few years ago, I came up with a brilliant new toxin that worked wonders. It took nearly 60 years off my face. The other problem was I drank the whole bottle, and all my notes were destroyed in a fight. Yeah, that, yeah, whatever. So I'm sorry to say I can't offer you some, but I must say you don't exactly look like you need it. Bye. 
Why, thank you. Take care. What? I didn't see a thing. Damn straight you didn't. <laughs> To type it here. Oh, okay. That's probably the best way for them to go about it. Anyways, I'm going to sleep in here. What can I do for you? How do you do? What can I do for you? Well met. Welcome to the bloated float. She's the finest inn on the water in all Cyrodiil. Cool. Can I sleep here? There's a room, all right, and a fine room it is. Yours for the night are only ten gold. Sweet, I'll a take it. A wise choice indeed. You've never had a night's rest like this, I assure you. The room is down below deck. It's the door on the left. Mm. Farewell. Is he so creepy? I feel like he's threatening you. Nah, he's fine. I've awakened to find that the bloated float has somehow put the sea with myself on board. Or put to sea with myself on board. I need to find the owner and discover what's happened. Hey, how's it going? Hey, who in oblivion are you? You don't look like one of the Blackwater brigands. No, I was just sleeping, man. I'm just a passenger. What? I was told there are only two others on board. I locked the bouncer in the storage room, and she has the owner. So that leaves you. You got beautiful blue eyes, now man. Now I'll ask again. Who are you? I'm the Arena Grand Champion? I, I'm, I'm a member of your gang? There's no one else in our group except the four of us. The Blackwater Brigands don't just take on new members out of the clear blue sky. When we formed the Brigands three months ago, <coughs> I was told no more than a four-way split on all the profits. So stop telling lies and tell me what you're doing here. I'm not going to say. Then perhaps my sword can find the words that your mouth cannot. Push. Oh. <laughs> oh, I love that. I've killed a thief named Lynch. Apparently, he's a member of some group called themselves the Blackwater Brigands. They must have hijacked the bloated float and put her out to sea. It appears that Lynch has locked the bloated float's bouncer in the storage room. I should search his body and see if there's a key on to free him. God, that dude was level 20. He got fucked. Oh, I should read these. Each of these, are each of these worth? They're worth XP, fuck yeah. Oh, whoops. Oh yeah. Knock, knock. Hey, how's it going, man? Thank you for freeing me. Hi. I'm Graman Gramarad, the bloated floats bouncer and helmsman. I've been locked in that storage room for hours. This storage room, you're still I don't in know it. exactly what's going on, but not long ago, a gang of thieves calling themselves the Blackwater Brigands stormed the ship. Yeah, I already killed one. They took myself and Normal, the float's owner, hostage and put the ship to sea. I have no idea what they're after. Yeah, don't worry. I if you uh, can I'll get me safely to the top deck, I can steer the float home. But I'm not budging until the coast is clear. I'm used to dealing with drunken louts, not a gang of well-armed thieves. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Hmm. That was weird. 
is, uh, am I still alive? Did things break? Am I okay? We good? Okay. I, on my end, it looked like shit broke for a moment. Okay. I was scared. Good luck. You'll need it. Anyways, let's go push some people. I wonder if you can charm them. Nipple touch. Oh, there. Where do you think you're going? Celine's not going to like this one bit. I wasn't to be disturbed. Um, Lynch sent me up here. Lynch set you up here? Why? Did he send you to talk to Celine? Yes, I'm to assist her. What does she need assistance with? She has Ormil under her own watchful eye in his cabin. Something isn't right here. What happened to Lynch? He's dead. You? You bested Lynch? I always knew he was out of practice. Oh, well, I suppose it's up to me to do his job for him, as usual. I've killed a second... <laughs> I've pushed a second thief. This one, a dark elf named Minx. Seems like these thieves are using strange code names. The only useful bit of advice I discovered is that their leader seems to be named Celine. I should search her belongings for anything to use, then make my way to the top deck and secure the ship's wheel for Grimand. Nice, a rip here. I'll wait on the tavern deck until you clear the top deck. That's where the ship's <laughs> wheel is located. Why won't you? I await your return, if you return. <laughs> Do you question my power? Do you question my power, orc? Ah, what are you doing up here? They find the Golden Galleon yet? I'm awaiting orders. Wait, get away from that wheel! Over my dead body. Oh. <laughs> I've slain yet another thief. This one a large nor named Wrath. He was guarding the ship's wheel. He mentioned that they hijacked the bloated float to recover something called the Golden Galleon. I should now get Gramman and tell him that the path to the ship's wheel is safe. Gonna take their weapons since they're worth money. Ah, uh, they have an invisible barrier right here. I can't toss him over. This womps. Hey, dude. Sounds like the coast is clear, so I'll make my way up to the ship's wheel. But I'm not moving this hulk an inch until Ormil is safe. <sighs> Fine. Fine, I'll go get Ormil. Be cautious. Their leader sounds dangerous. Oh, <laughs> uh, we'll see. How'd you get in here? Uh, I took the key from Wrath. Wrath? I told him to guard the wheel and not talk to anybody. Who are you? Uh, I'm just the ship's cook. There's no cook on board the bloated float. How dare you try and make a fool of me? After I deal with you, I'll feed your body to the slaughterfish. I... Uh... Ah, by Azura, by Azura, by... I've decided to kill Selene. Now that she's dead, I should speak to Armiel. It's the grand champion. I can't believe it's you standing here next to me. I've always been standing next to you, kid. You've kind of been following me for a while now. I I like how they get insulted over being lied to instead of worried that you somehow managed to get the key 
from oh, the other goodness. people. That horrid woman kept threatening me. She <laughs> said if I didn't come up with a loot, she'd throw me to the slaughterfish. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, tell me about her. It's a pity she wouldn't surrender. Such a waste of a young life. I know, right? Anyways, yeah, the Blackwater Brigands, that's what they're called. Well, I'm afraid all of this was my fault. They hijacked the bloated float because of me. Business has been waning of late, so I invented a story. Uh-huh. I fashioned a tale about a golden galleon that the previous owner hid within this very vessel. Mm -hmm. It was to be a statuette made completely of gold. At the time, the idea was quite clever, I thought. I figured the law would draw more curiosity seekers and adventurers looking for the treasure. What could the harm be if while they were here, they bought a drink <coughs> or two? My business has increased quite a bit since I leaked the story. Well, obviously, I was mistaken. It was a terrible idea. I'm just glad that no innocents were hurt. I wouldn't want to have their blood on my hands. Anyway, sorry to ramble. You better get below now and rest until we arrive safely at the Imperial City docks. I better get free food and drink for my entire life while I'm here. Please, go get some rest. Man, he doesn't even have any good shit. It's all like cheap wines. Thanks again for helping us. I'm sure Ormil will reward you appropriately. Crap I the sailor. Well, back to bed we go. No, you stay outside. Yes, oh great and mighty grand champion. Is there something? You stay outside. <laughs> Never mind all the corpses around. I need to hit the sack. Yeah, you get it. The bloated float has arrived back at the Imperial City. I should speak with Ormail before I disembark. I like how I know this while I'm below deck. I don't know how I know this. I'm just like, well, we, we, we're done. You're awake. Good. I didn't want to disturb you. I suppose you're wondering what I did with Selene. I fucked the authorities her at the Imperial times. City took her off the ship as soon as we docked. I was also informed that there was a reward for her capture. Here you go. Don't spend it all in one place. Unless it's here, of course. Cool. Um. So, yeah, that's Celine. She was a ruthless woman, and I'm glad she's gone. Such a waste. Yep. Blurred flow. Yes. The float is quite a vessel, don't you think? Bought all... Okay. Farewell, my friend. Man. What an adventure. This float is certainly going to get bloated here. with all those dead bodies around. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. They, they got him off the ship. They got him off the ship, it's fine. That's actually one of my more favorite quests for this game. <laughs> The spell doesn't work. The ship doesn't meet safety standards. It it doesn't even have a below deck. It doesn't even have a crew. It doesn't have anything. This place sucks. <laughs> oh, that's just the right amount of stupid right there. Scrap by the sailor man. Oh, hey, sweet lady of Wares. Oh, hey, sweet lady of mine. I'll see you again. Yes, I'll see you again. Where's the time? Yeah, it's close to my end time. Hand me the hyper screwdriver to ease the mooring junction of the sail suspension. <laughs> mm. 
smart crabs. I won't let them rip her apart after I've fixed everything. I go for sure not into these waters. What's the news from the <laughs> parts of Tamriel? Listen, I've got a lot of work to do. <laughs> I want you to imagine in the middle of fucking Star Wars, in the middle of like Star Wars episode, I don't know, six or something, Chewbacca just turned to Han and said, what are we going to do, Han? And he goes, what? what? <laughs> Captain Anzol, and this is my first mate, Huey. I need a fast ship. Sorry, boy, but I've taken enough heat lately by some foreigners. Now we only set sail for Bravillians. Son of a bitch, I have to be a Bravillian in order. Let me on that ship. Let me on that. Fu God, why is your ship so fucked up? I go for sure not into these waters. It's our natural barriers that keep us safe, mostly. Mountain <laughs> borders north and east, open sea to the west, this and bogs and rainforests. This game is stupid. I love it. I love modders, and I love what they do. Oh, hello. Well, uh, one good way to end the night. Better them than me. I push everyone. Better them than me. Yep. Oh, I'm gonna push these guys into the water. You oh. seem to be in some trouble. Oh, this is gonna be good. You some kind of maniac? Oh, they didn't fall in the water at all. Oh wow, that guy was level forty. <laughs> that made nothing. He had a long so Huh. Small people scare me, Duke. <laughs> Listen, we're limiting the amount of people so that the cost of housing goes down. It's been too long since I've seen a good brawl. You get to live. Hey. How did you do that for me? <laughs> hmm. I'm coming to arrest you. Ah! It's ah. been too long since Ooh. I've. By the gods! Ah. How could you do such a thing? Proud match, Del. I'm just pushing oh old people Ooh. around. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Someone's been. Ugh. Push. <laughs> I push. <laughs> to me, it's nothing but a game. A game. Sorry, I interrupt your conversation. My God, how could you do such a thing? Pretty easily, in fact. Be free, my sheep! Hmm. Will anything be able to stop me? How about... Ooh, I hope you know... Nope. Oh. <laughs> This is an easy way to level up. Just get a fuckload of infamy by killing everyone. <laughs> I stop right there, criminal. Scum. Wait, what? Nobody breaks the law. And You're not a guard. I'm confiscating your stolen goods. Now pay your fine, or it's off to jail. Oh, only 2,160? Too much. 
<laughs> By the gods, how could you do such a thing? <laughs> Remember in Fable how uh, if the owner of a house died, you Sounds could like buy their home? Gods! What's going on? By the gods! Someone's been murdered. Murder! Oh. <laughs> Damn it, not, not a single one of them died. You motherfuckers. Did you say a psychopath? No. A god. How? Wait. How? How? Like Boulder's Gates way of doing it most of doing what most? Either you can kill anything in the game where it auto kills you. Oh yeah, no, nah, I'm I'm down for that. I absolutely killed everyone in Fable what? by their house and other properties. <laughs> I mean, it's just a worthwhile venture, you know. I killed everyone? Is it over? Will will no one else come for me? Oh, nope, there's you. Stop. No. That <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop. Please! Someone's been murdered! Ha! <laughs> hold on, hold on. Time out. I need I need to take my medicine, hold on. Oh uh, yep, that's a good suppository. Uh, there we go. Ah, oh, they finally got me. Hank the Low killed me. <laughs> I was killed by Hank the Low. <laughs> God, God damn it, Hank. <laughs> okay, that's uh, I think that's a good spot to end on. <laughs> We have found the champion of, uh, of Cyrodiil, the true hero that they rightfully deserve, Hank the Low. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let, let's stop there, then, for the sheep before you go. You may speak. Go, be free! You're free. <laughs> Can't believe Hank Hill Propane God resides here. God damn it. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream here. So thank you everyone that stopped by to watch. It was nice having y'all. Seriously, it was it was a fun stream. What was I doing to that sheep? Don't worry about it. Uh, I think next stream. Next stream, I think I will do. 
I think I'll do the Fighters Guild next stream. You know, do all of the infamy uh, quest lines, you know, uh, later. <laughs> so yeah, uh, here we got uh, we got a pretty good amount of people uh, that are still around. Let's go raid Insano, who is playing some Subnautica Below Zero. Which, uh, is a game I could never play because I have a crippling fear of open oceans. So yeah, we'll go over to Insano and, uh, yeah, show, show him the love and make fun of him if he gets scared. So you all stay safe. Remember, do not text and drive. Do not drink and drive. Ten, two people, ten and two, and happy days and sunshine ahead if you are hanged to bed. Pleasant dreams and all that. I hope to see you all later, uh, specifically tomorrow, where I'll be playing more Oblivion. Until then, have a wonderful night. Bye-bye. Yeah, uh, and again, I'll be back on tomorrow, Dizzy, from... I don't do long streams, but I do do night streams. <laughs> I said doo-doo. Uh, yeah, from about 10 p.m. Central Standard Time to about 1 a.m. So, you all have a wonderful night. Take care of yourselves. Pleasant dreams and all that. Bye bye, you all. Nunu says good night as well. <laughs>